All right, good morning, everybody. My name is Joseph Stark, and um, this fall I'll be a senior at Oakland Technical High School. And this summer I worked at the East Bay Bicycle Coalition, or EBBC. EBBC is unique from a lot of the other agencies that uh, people here are working at because it's not a public sector agency. It's, a, uh, it's essentially an advocacy and lobby group for, uh, on behalf of bicyclists in the East Bay, in Alameda and Contra Costa County. And so what we do is um, work for better, better and safer bikeways throughout the East Bay on roads and highways and access to transit, you know, trains, buses, um, basically access for bicyclists to uh, all facilities that cars have access to. And so um, as part of that mission, we, uh, we also educate bikers and cars on the, uh, what the rights of bicyclists are and how, how bikes and cars should share the road. So what did I do this summer? I did a lot of research on uh, current bike conditions in Alameda and Contra Costa County, which is our region, and then compared it to situations for bikes around the country and around the world in uh, bike-friendly cities like Portland and Washington, D.C., and in Europe, like Copenhagen and um, even Paris. And so to that, to that end, I also went to uh, city council meetings and interacted with a lot of public works leaders. So I actually emailed a lot of these public works committees myself and talked about um, getting new bike facilities throughout the East Bay and um, did a lot of community outreach as well at uh, local street fairs like Art and Soul and the Temescal Street Fair right here in Oakland. And so there's a couple pictures here. This is me talking with a uh, BART director about bike access on the uh, new fleet of BART cars that are on display right now at MacArthur BART. Um, we were talking about how there's new bike racks on the BART cars and how they, uh, how they fit and the problems and our concerns with uh, the new bike facilities. This is me speaking in front of Oakland City Council about um, our support of the new bus rapid transit plan in East Oakland, which increases access for bicyclists and uh, facilities along International, a traditionally underserved area for bicycle amenities. Um, this is me doing community outreach and painting the street at the Temescal Street Fair. This is the intersection of Telegraph and Shattuck. And um, at this point, there's, a, uh, there's currently a hot dog stand there, the Casper's hot dog stand. And, uh, we are, uh, we're painting the street to show what it could be like if the corner was closed off to car traffic and open up to bicycles and pedestrians. And this is what I did in the office. This is the, uh, a map of every single new bus stop that's going on in, uh, along International in East Oakland. And at each one of these bus stops, I uh, did research and went out and took pictures of where potential bike parking spots could uh, be located and bike storage racks and compiled them all into a Google map and uh, put all the information there to uh, send to both AC Transit and to the bike storage folks who make the, uh, the bike storage lockers and to the city of Oakland as well. I also made a lot of graphs like this that uh, it's hard to see, but they detail um, public works projects throughout the East Bay. This is every single pavement rehabilitation project in Alameda and Contra Costa County and uh, how, they, how they give access to uh, bike lanes. And so each of these, uh, each of these projects in uh, every jurisdiction out here details um, what the current facilities are, what the new facilities will be, and that column on the right is the response from every single public works director that I, uh, that I reached out to. Um, so I also assessed and graded the current plans and what they uh, currently, currently give to a bicyclist, and it gave a letter grade to each one that we wrote into an e-blast and sent out to our uh, nearly 5,000 members. And uh, so I learned, learned a number of skills this summer about um, not only writing newsletters and press releases, but how to interact with city leaders and public works officials, and um, to do a lot of public speaking in front of both city council and to the community, and how to follow detailed directions in an office environment. Um, so in my future, I, uh, I'll be honest, before I started this internship, I drove a lot, but um, I can now see that driving is not the most efficient and best way to get around, and so I plan to bike more in the future, and recognize that bicyclists are a valuable part of the transportation network and that there are a lot of people that rely solely on their bicycles to get around and the roads should be safe for them as well as for drivers. That's it. Thanks so much.